Now, here's a detail most reports skipped. Aaron became the first hurricane of the 2025 Atlantic season, but it's already the fifth named storm. That tells you something. The season started in June, and we've burned through five names by mid-August. Historically, the peak of hurricane season doesn't hit until mid-September. So what happens if we're already this active now? NOAA's latest forecast still stands. Six to ten hurricanes expected this year, with three to five becoming major storms. And get this, including Aaron, there have only been 43 Category 5 hurricanes ever recorded in the Atlantic. This would be the fourth year in a row one has formed. Four years. In a row. That's not random. That's a pattern. Did you notice how hurricane specialist Michael Lowry called Aaron's intensification incredible for any time of year, let alone August 16th? That's not just a throwaway line. August is early for a storm this strong. The ocean usually needs more time to heat up. But this year, sea surface temperatures across the Caribbean and Gulf are running 1 to 2 degrees Celsius above average. That's like turning the stove up under a pot of water. It boils faster. And hurricanes feed on that heat.